it's in the way, but that's where it ended up today. I don't know why. So, um, I am um, on my way into Keene. I am purchased, or I'm going to purchase, a lawnmower, used lawnmower, for $50. That they claim works, but has a leak in the gas tank, which is not a problem for me because I have a lawnmower on my property that's been sitting there all year that has the same Briggs and Stratton engine on it. Um, it has a blown engine, but the gas tank is fine, so I'm just going to switch that out and then I can finally mow my lawn, which is already gone to seed. So that's my th big thing for today, plus I need to get some heads for Val, and uh, hopefully something cool will happen along the way that I can share with you guys, otherwise it's just a nice drive on a relatively warm day. to get your new washing machine happening. Yes. So I need your opinion here. Is that like I can give you the opinions that you give me when I ask you how this looks? Sure. Why not? <laughs> you're, you're the one who wanted this thing. Just remember that. I'm the one who wanted clean I'm, clothes. I'm just trying to make it happen. Oh, what are my options? All right. You follow me. Take the camera. <coughs> Come on. I get to film his butt. Come on. No <laughs> one wants to see that. <laughs> All right. So, we got you this thing. We were supposed to hook it up in here. Machine. All right. I actually put it in the, in the bathroom. But oh, you there did? was a couple of options. I, try, I thought of uh, videos that I watched had people sitting it on top of the counter. Yeah. And then I have to be like up but, here to right. get things in and out of it. So, and that, because it has a, a gravity feed drain. So, that's not an option. We'd have to move the microwave, blah, blah, blah. The, the other bathroom was a, also an option, but uh, it would have to sit in the tub. And the tub has a slight angle to it, and it's not good for it. So, I was thinking... This he was is, thinking, guys, that's pretty scary. Little bathroom. This really? is my pretty bath. You still need to fix that spot on the wall right there. It, it's on the list. <laughs> so, how do you turn the lights on in here? Okay, so here's the, the washing machine. I don't know if anybody's seen one of these before. It's not exactly... It, it says it was a washer dryer, but it isn't really. It'll wash on this side, and then you move it on this side to do a spin. So they. So it doesn't it, spin in this side at all. It just no, it right from there to there. It agitates. Okay. And um, so I was going to attach it to this sink because I we have one. You know, I don't know if we actually went over this at all, but the hot line downstairs we it, it broke over the winter because of uh, it froze but the the cold water actually works and I turned that back on however this doesn't go on to it this cheesy little hose I'm hoping since these come off that uh, the one in the kitchen is smaller and I didn't know they were interchangeable like that. Well, yeah. It's a standard thread, as long as the thread size is the same. And this already looks better. It has a little taper on it. Hopefully that will help it. That works. So this isn't like a washing machine where you just throw stuff in and then just turn it on and walk away. You have, you have to be a little more proactive with it. 
A lot of people probably asking why do we have this? Okay, so we have this because, and please don't mind my hair and everything, I'm oh, a mess. Yeah, um, we have, we picked this up. It's tiny. It's not going to do a large load. It's not going to fit my blankets and quilts and all that. But, considering the fact that we have a washer and two dryers down there now, right? No, yes. A washer and two dryers. The original dryer doesn't work anymore, right? Right. It just doesn't do And it. the washer is hit and miss. It's on, yeah, it's on its last leg. And the new dryer, well, not new, the other dryer that we have down there, Kevin seems to have a problem with it. <laughs> well, it, well, it, I got it for free. And, it sh and the person I got it from said that uh, it works, sometimes it doesn't, the heating element doesn't come on, which is what it does. Some, and we also have issues with our electric panel. Uh, it, this dryer should be on it, on a separate, a separate line, but there are other things on it. So if you're running the dryer and then someone turns a light on upstairs, it'll blow Boop. the circuit. Pop. It's, it's really nutty, but uh, it's on the list. It's on the list. Hey, I don't care what's on the list as long as I get to do some laundry. So, um, see if this is going to work. Now. Wrong side. Okay, now I'll we'll see what that's all about. This has to go over here. Uh, so now you're not going to reach the toilet with the or the uh, shower. Yeah, but we'll turn it when we need it to. Oh, okay. It doesn't have to stay on. Yeah. Now, how do you get the water out of the side you just put in? Out of this side? Yeah. Well, it's going to spin. And also, I it I occurred to me that you wash the clothes, but it doesn't rinse it. What do you mean it doesn't rinse it? It'll just wash the clothes and and you'll take take it out and put it on this side. Some of the people in the videos put water into here so that it gives it some a bit of a Because otherwise a it's gonna have soap in it, right? Right. Okay. So there's a couple of things you could do. You could run it with soap first, then drain it, and then run it without soap, then drain it, and then put it into the spinner. So, well, we'll have to experiment and see which way said, goes best. Become more proactive than. Yeah. Well, did you want to throw clothes in here? Yeah. You want to take this, or do you want? There. Now it's filling the right side. All right. And I just put the laundry soap and everything right on top in there, right? Yes. It has no separate plate. No. I know it's not going to hold a lot of clothes. Uh -huh. So, one, two, three, four, five, six. I think that's good. Yeah, probably. That's good. I'll wait until the water gets to the top of it. And you might want to put some of that in now. Yeah, that's your. This is the softener. And that's the wash. All right. Now. I don't know how to get this open. I hate these all things. All right, let me stop this and I'll do that. Okay. Too. All right, so I'm gonna probably just go with four. It's brand new, so it's gotta work its way up. Okay. All right. Now I can put softener in there right now too, right? I, I suppose. And washer whips I'm not going to be able to use because it's not going to dry like a... Why? But the washer whips going with the wash. What? This goes in with the wash. Oh, it does, doesn't it? Boy, oh boy. My brain is not working. I'm telling you, this is disgustingly dirty. Oh, well, it's been in the basement. Thank you. What a mess you made. Mm. Think that's good? This looks good to me. Yay, so there we go. Now let's put it on. 15 minutes. There we go. God, it must do a really good job if you're only washing it for 15 minutes. Mm -hmm. All right, so we'll let dust do its thing for 15 minutes. 
and then we'll empty it and fill it again. With just plain water. With yeah, clean water, and then we put it into this side. And then I have a little rack to hang everything on. All right. All right. Well, let's wait for this to finish, and then we'll. Okay. We'll I again. see a cobweb. Oh my God. Well, I haven't been in this bathroom. There's dead spider over here. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, dead spider. Mm -hmm. All right. Say bye. Bye, guys. We'll see you later. It still has water in it. Yeah. So what do I do? I have, to, have to take the it. clothes out. No. 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 Okay. So I have to move this because it's going to be in the way. Uh huh. And I'm going to. All right. Let's unplug this so that's not. A problem. Okay. All right. Oh. Here you go. Yeah, do that. Just set it in there like that. Uh huh. And then you put it on the drain. And there it goes. Feel like we're back in the uh, 19th century. Hey, at least you know I should be outside with the thing. And I can get you one of those ringer things where you put the clothes into between the rollers and you. I remember those when I was a kid. Okay, hon. <laughs> I don't remember those. You don't, I do huh? remember having to hang all the laundry on the clotheslines. I think this is going to work out pretty good, or you know fairly well considering you know what the hell are you doing i kicked the trash can <laughs> kick the bucket huh? kick the bucket um so yeah i think this is gonna work out it's gonna take a lot of loads to get all that laundry caught up but all right so i can do it at my leisure so it's drained as much as it's gonna so now i, I think turn you it should back I think we should run it in clear water. Okay. Uh, it's leaking over here, babe. Uh, 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 uh. What did you do? You didn't have it in there. Sure. So, this is actually smaller than the... And the idea is, I think, is if it's spinning, it might start shooting out the top. So this will stop it because it's bigger than that. Okay. So that's a necessity, I think. I don't know. I'll find out. Ivy. Ivy. What is Daddy doing? What is Daddy doing? He's making a lot of noise. He does. But it's not feeding her, so she doesn't really care. Isn't that right? You Piggly Wiggly. He's a Tootsie Roll. How are you working on over there that you're making so much noise? Your drying rack. My drying rack? Your drying rack. That means only my clothes can go on it. <laughs> piece of junk. It is not. Piece of Then he's going to complain his hand hurts. <laughs> Don't use your hand as a hammer. All right. Say goodbye. Goodbye. So here's our super high-tech drying system for our clothes. <laughs> On wheels. Hey, you know, you got to do what you got to do. <laughs> Where are you Don't no, come in here with it. You don't want to, it's on wheels. You can put right from the washer into this and we can move it wherever you want. Oh, we'll put it right here then. Hmm. <sighs> They're not bad. Mm hmm. Hey guys. Did you finish all the laundry? Oh yeah, it's all done. You're all done. Folded, put away everything. Good. Happy to hear it. No, but I'm done for the night since it's 9 o'clock and I'm getting ready to settle down for a while. Mm -hmm. And I'll probably get back up about midnight and do some more. There you go. So, but uh, I've just been working on some different garland. Oh, my yellow bird fell. 
some different garland because the first one I did was very, very full. I like it full, but not everybody does. So I did this one and I tried to put little branches going off to the side in some places. And so that's what I got. Now I got to put lights on it and then put it in the bird cage and it's going to kind of go like like that in the bird cage okay from the bottom to the top like that mm. and I don't know if I'm going to try and set the birds on this or put different ones just going across for the birds oh oh bird mm. down just, down. just knocking everything over over here. I am. Um, but I love my new, new little washer and dryer thingy. It's uh, it actually does a really good job on drying them. Well, I mean, it spins all the water out, but it doesn't really. But that's our dryer. Our washer didn't do that half the time. Yeah, it's, it's gotten tired, that old thing yeah. downstairs. Who knows how old it is. Yeah. So came with the house. I <laughs> hope that this hangs in there for a while. I don't want to overuse it, but I need to get caught up. Mm -hmm. So we will get it set up. I mean, I will get it set on a schedule where I do maybe like two loads a day or until I get it done. Mm -hmm. So I'm not over killing it in one day. I think that'll make a difference. Oh, I think so. So I don't know. Anyway. I'm tired. My hand, hands and my arms hurt from uh, wrapping wire and stuff, so I'm going to go to sleep. Oh, okay. What are you going to do? I'm going to put up this log. Okay, and tomorrow we have nothing scheduled, right? We don't need to go anywhere. No, I can work on the room here. That's what I was just about to say. Well, good. And I could do the laundry while you're working on the room. Good. Okay. So, all right, guys. Hugs. Kisses. Love y'all. See you next time. Bye.